Good morning, my dear Busconians and my dear Lemisha partners. As we start a new week, we remember our countrymen who are suffering because of the recent typhoon. People are still uh, not in good situation. Houses are buried with mud. Lives were lost and properties were destroyed. May our striving to grow in the virtue of responsibility be our little uh, contribution to ease the suffering of our people. Let us watch this short video clip for our reflection this morning. are really inspiring. The video clip we just watched a while ago show us how this young man is striving to uh, really study well, sacrificing day in, day out, okay? working in the field, uh, enduring the looks of people who are uh, putting him down and to endure and in the end he emerged as a doctor director at that of an ICU unit you see responsibility is not, not just a good word responsibility entails sacrifice responsibility entails hard work responsibility entails doing something to make your dreams come true. We take our lesson in developing responsibility in a website called goodcharacter.com and an article there, uh, three R's of growing up. It's an, an article for teachers as their guide. Okay? It says there the three R's of growing up are responsibility, self-respect, and doing the right thing. Let's see the first of these uh, elements. The first aspect in growing into responsibility is uh, be trustworthy. Be trustworthy, especially in little things. We grow in responsibility when uh, all our tasks are done, be it big or small. Like in the video clip, we saw how that young man really find time to study. Even people are taunting him, he continued on studying. Okay? And because he was trustworthy with the little things, with his own uh, effort to study, he was rewarded of being uh, a nurse, a doctor, and a head of an ICU unit at that. Our best example here is the gospel reading yesterday about the parable of the talents. Okay? The Lord uh, said that God gave us different talents okay? some many some few but all have talents 
and when we put into good use our talents, then we are rewarded. I believe the reward there is responsibility. When you are uh, responsible in little things, like the master in the gospel reading said, then you will be trusted with bigger things. The second aspect in growing in responsibility is choosing the right things. You see, life is a choice. We are always uh, confronted with choices to make, big and, and small. And when we always choose the right things, then we grow in responsibility. My example here are, are our local government units in the time of this uh, different calamities. Uh, you know that Filipinos are uh, not easily being swayed to move from their place to another because of the different threats of flood, of uh, landslide. But since our LGU units were really up and about during these uh, recent typhoons, a lot of lives were saved. At times you go against the tide. You go against people for doing the right things and they will be really saying a lot of things about you. Do still the right thing. And when you do that, you grow in responsibility. And the last uh, aspect of growing in responsibility is self-respect. When we uh, choose to live up to our principles, our highest values, when you bring out the best in you, that is self-respect. I am happy that uh, our SE officers, the senior high school and the junior high school are combined once again to launch the Buskong Kayantabe 2.0. Okay. Last time, the, the SE officers who graduated organized this uh, fund drive for our frontliners. This time, they made their hearts uh, really feel for the people who are suffering. And so they are launching this fund drive. And I would like to encourage you, my dear Bosconians, my dear parents, our EPC in Don Bosco Academy and the Friends of Don Bosco. Let us support this fund drive of our school. This bringing out of the best in us, especially in this moment of great need to help, to have concern for them, is a form of self-respect. And when you do that, you grow in responsibility. Before I end this talk, I would like to greet advance happy birthday to Sir Jarvis Wano, one of our pastoral team member. We ask the Lord to bless him together with his family and friends and to uh, shower him with all his graces. Once again, good morning to all of you and God bless our DPA family.